Every year on the last day of school, we celebrate students by rejoicing in everything that they've accomplished this year. This year, it even means more because of everything that we've overcome, all the challenges we've risen to and gone beyond because of the pandemic. And we start with the smallest kids to the biggest kids because we really don't want to overwhelm the little ones. And so then we end up with our fifth graders and they just rejoice and like, yes, we've done this. It's a beautiful, wonderful thing. It's been a tradition here at Mountain View for probably 25 years, if not longer. I've been here since 1994 and we've done it, I think, just about every year. And we just celebrate students and our job well done. It's a celebration of the job well done. It's a celebration of our community. We come together. We are a large school, but it's beautiful to say goodbye and send off every single child and every single staff member every year. It's a Mountain View tradition. What was your favorite part about this school year? Um, I really enjoyed just being with my friends and I probably had my favorite year to just be around other people and it was really nice because I just haven't been that social the past couple years so I just really enjoyed that. The fact that we're not stuck at home doing Zoom. How there's been so many people nice in the school to take everybody in. What are you looking forward to for the summer? Looking forward to spending a lot of time with my friends, hanging out with them a lot. What are you looking forward to next year when you go to middle school? I guess I'm looking forward to the higher level of responsibility that also comes with a higher level of privileges if those responsibilities are properly taken care of. What piece of advice would you give to someone who's going to be in the fifth grade next year? Um, be kind and work hard. What we want to send students off with is just a sense of accomplishment, to be proud of themselves, to relax and enjoy the summer, to read, play with numbers, and we just can't wait to see you back next year in August.